All right, I'm now going to talk about making new instruments out of a bunch of random drum sounds for the EXS24. It's a plug-in in Logic here. You can see that's a sampler. So, basically what I do, I hit the edit button. Edit. Can you see? Bloop. And that pops up. And you want to make, let's see, new. Now it's blank. And go to the zone menu. Hit load multiple samples. Then a big box comes up. And that's where you go select wherever you're storing your samples. In this case, Steve Lou sent me several gig of new just random drum sounds he's collected from random places. Okay, so I'm going to load up a new bank of symbols. He's actually put them in uh, folders. Each folder contains 88 different sounds, which I will then map chromatically, starting at the bottom of the keyboard, all the way to the top, so that every key has a different sample on it. Very cool. Okay, so you select one, and then you hit add all and then it adds all of them and then you go over there all right hit done and you'll want to do contiguous zones and then starting note you want to make that a negative one which is the very first a that is if C3 is your middle C, if that makes any sense. Okay. If C4 is your middle C, you'll want to make that A0. Then hit OK. Uh, then it basically chromatically maps out. There's sample one. There's sample two. Here's three. All right, so there's a bunch of symbol rolls here. Let's see what's up here. So now you see every key. Uh, there's sounds. Okay, so then we'll close it. It'll say, do you want to save? Yes, save. Then you pick the folder where you want to store it in. In this case, I'm calling it Lou Drums 2010. We're going to make a new folder called Symbols. Within the Symbols, we're going to call this Symbols 1. Hit Save. Gonna think. Come on. All right. So now it gives you when you pull down the menu to select a sound. Here's all the stuff. So I'll scroll down to Lou Drums 2010. Then within that, you'll see my newly created folder called Symbols, and then Symbols One. Load that, and now it's loaded. And then you can play it each sound and it's that easy so now I have a whole lot more banks to do uh, yeah I won't bore you with that <laughs> uh, that's what I do all day getting sounds see ya